So welcome, 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 guys. Uh, today we are playing Aircraft Carrier Survival Prologue. This seems to be a teaser into the game. Let me, I'll probably just move up here. Uh, this is probably a teaser. Uh, it seems I haven't played it yet. I've just seen some uh, footage and stuff from it. Um, uh, and it seems to be like you are managing the... Um, Oh, what's it called? Not the repair party, but uh, the the firefighters and the uh, people dealing with breaches and repairing, like stopping flooding. Uh, repair control party is that repair party? No, Jeez, okay, whatever. You you seem to be controlling them on the aircraft carrier. <laughs> Long story short, I don't know if you control the rest of the crew as well. Uh, but the devs was kind enough to give this key to me for free uh so <laughs> thank you bot <laughs> uh so do keep that in mind um but uh, yeah uh like i said never played this before let us uh let us just uh jump in on this new game campaign sandbox this seems to be very early uh this seems to be very unfinished yet still very much in early access like the graphics settings is basically a slider uh audio setting like it's um they have better audio settings than they have like graphics control also i saw in the intro film you get because this is apparently the early 2000s and we have a introduction film when we start up the game the animations there were pretty rough i do like the rough animations here that style is pretty cool um it sort of adds a bit to the pantry feel, but there is a boat that goes along here uh, that that uh, just pops out of existence at some points. Anyways, new game, campaign, normal. Make this harder. I uh, hope you're all doing it, having a good morning, by the way. Um, you want to skip the tutorial? No. Like this boat. See here. See, 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 see. And poof, <laughs> then it just spawns over there. That seems to be an animation quirk. They fucked up the keys there. No, oh, I don't want to skip the tutorial. I very much need a tutorial. Welcome, Admiral. Please take a moment to customize your look. This is how you will be represented in the campaign. You will not be able to edit the look later. So do make sure every detail is to your liking. Okay, I do like the voice. That does save my voice. Uh, why, why, why am I standing? <laughs> this is literally it's an A-pose with breathing attached. Oh my god, why are you so scared? Great Seamaster. Yeah, a flying ace. It doesn't say what the different do. Oh, okay. <laughs> Basically, flips. Do I have more navy or do I have more air? Uh, obviously, we are uh, Captain M. Moran. Uh, why don't you generate the portrait based on why I I'm customizing myself? Why aren't you basing the portrait on what I'm customizing? <laughs> Hard work is what keeps the ship moving. Oh my god, that was loud. Hard work is what keeps the ship moving. Okay, uh, that was a lot of... That was very... <laughs> yeah, I don't really care that too much. Oh, accessory. <laughs> oh, hell yeah! Is this Sea of Thieves? Wait, what? <laughs> What's fucking... Oh, he... Wait, can we be like Douglas fucking MacArthur? <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? Why? This isn't shirt. This is just top. This is jacket. Obviously, Admiral. Oh my god. French coat. Oh my god. What? Do we have anything underneath here? 
Oh guys! Oh wow! <laughs> this is cyber. Okay, someone have way too much fun in substance designer or substance painter. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Don't we have uh, just a navy blue shirt? Maybe I skip that. Five. Okay. Wow. Okay. Wow. Can I rot rotate? No, I can't. Okay. The customization. Why is there no music in the customization, by the way? <laughs> okay, we're just gonna go for the jackets. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Them socks, yo. Oh, my God. I guess that's matching. This jacket does not look like it fit in very well. Oh yeah, I'm gonna try to get the voice volume down as well. That was very loud. Sir, welcome to Pearl Harbor. The strike group will return here after every successful mission in order to prepare for the next one. Oh hell yeah. Pearl fucking Harbor can I? The strike group can be purchased here. No! Every upgrade will cost upgrade points. No, oh, the, the menu is hidden behind the tutorial. Guys. No, I can't. Have a look through the different tabs, sir. Each one will allow you to manage a specific aspect of your strike group. This is this is just bound to create a bug at some point. If if I need to click something now. But I have the menu open, that's gonna be like be bound to uh, fuck something up. All the settings. Uh, voice. Probably just move this bit down as well. Like if I get an explosion that's super high, I don't really wanna. Okay, so we have two upgrade points. What is this? Command points. Used to hire and upgrade officers. Oh, I can't. Turn around this. That would have been really cool. Strength in number. So even a powerful ship such as your aircraft carrier does not travel alone, sir. Here you can set up your naval escort. This voice is super low, but the voice in when we were testing voices were super high. Like are they connected now or not? And I didn't actually. There is a strength in numbers, and so even a powerful ship such as the aircraft carrier does not travel alone, sir. You can set up your escort. There's a carrier defense, escort defense, extra supplies, extra squadrons, okay? We have an escort carrier and we have a cargo ship and a supply ship. Then we like have a destroyer. You can upgrade your escort size here. It will let you add more vessels to your Okay, cool. List of all the ships currently in your escort. Those two should have been flipped. Each ship provides a different bonus. So Oh fuck, I forgot to set extra settings on that. Because for some reason, when I, 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 I feel I've like quadruple checked the setting that I do not record in 1280p, but I know in in 720p, but I do. And I feel like I checked that setting that it says that I'm like that my output is like 1920 by 1080 so many times. But I checked yesterday and it was like oh, 1280 by 720. It's like, oh, fuck. I forgot to change that now. Click here to change. Can I have a... Uh, oh, I can have a fucking cruiser with me. <laughs> oh, nice. Hell yeah. Cruiser, light cruiser, destroy... I can have a su like support sub. Might be nice to have a... Wow, that's a nice camo. Nice. Might be nice to have a... Uh, yeah, it's a bit of inconsistency here. Like you have like, like why is first of all why are they like why didn't say like so high in the water? They should be lower. Also, why is our support carrier just white while these are okay? Uh, maybe this is also very white. Uh, whatever detail. Vowel, vowel, no, this is like, well, you know, when you press R 
on valves to put out fires it's just that basically i think it's it's that part of the game uh okay so and then we have our carrier Oh, we can. <gasps> oh, we can rename. Oh, we can rename it. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. In the demo, there is only one carrier class available to you. But in the full version of the game. Okay, so this is demo. This is paid demo, though. I think. But you know what? I'm gonna double check that. I'm gonna double check. This is. If I wish it. Was it the shop page? I mean, I can still see price, right? Never fucking mind. This is free. Okay, cool beans. I thought that was actually paid. So, uh, probably would be nice to add extra radar range and stuff. Uh, this is where your true power lies, sir. Or in this case, flies. These are the machines. <laughs> and here's where your true power flies. Do make sure they are well prepared. <laughs> wow. Here you can increase the amount of squadron slots available on your flight deck. This means that you will have more squadrons ready, ready for orders at a given time. Okay. slots officer slots launch by the way we're gonna up the voice volume again hopefully we don't get like super high voice okay so this is everything okay i mean obviously <laughs> Easy clap. Let's see. Um, do we increase our radar range? Maybe. Oh. Okay, I have a feeling having a. If we, how much does it take to? Okay, can I just do like this? And then get a uh, destroyer. Nice, okay, and then if we go to carrier. Then we increase detectability of the aircrafts. Or the anti-aircraft capabilities, because destroyer will do uh, AWS warfare for us. Uh, so I feel uh, it looks a bit cooler though with more guns. <laughs> Let's upgrade our radar. Increase the detection. Um, crew, uh, the Navy having Navy skill allows officers to generate Navy points. It said something about like getting to upgrade using this co command points used to hire and upgrade crew members. Like, how do I upgrade though? I can't. Oh. Upgrade crew. Okay. But why could I upgrade you? Oh, is it because you have like those two stars? Okay. Oh, wait. You got new. <laughs> Did you get new skills every time I. <laughs> so you can just like keep pressing until you get something good. Deck in DC. Uh, deck grants additional efficiency when. Uh, damage control. Thank you. That's why we're doing damage control navigation let's do damage control 
engineering efficiency when assigned to engineering department oh you can also like, it seems so random how do oh you have two stripes sorry i didn't see that lone wolf grants additional when assigned to a department loan oh, let's give you oh well, i'm out okay it takes me two per okay i did not see that i thought i had more okay you know what let's uh kick it off then let's launch easy easy clap okay we can only do that but we'll see aftermath the japanese imperial army has begun an operation to cut off our allies port moresby and the islands near Tulagi are key strategic points on the Coral Sea. Without them, providing support to Australia and New Zealand will be nearly impossible. We must interrupt the Japanese plans at all costs. Our intelligence intercepted messages with the exact date and location of the invasion. We have yet to confirm, but have yet to confirm the path. Your task is to destroy the invasion fleet headed for Port Moresby. Uh, objective prevent Jap uh, Japan's advance before they reach the shores of New Guinea our goal is to sink a majority of ships before from the invasion fleet and disengage before the reinforcements arrive I know we haven't played yet guys but I'm already super excited <laughs> if there was like skins in here <laughs> oh god I got a problem hey I am fidelity Welcome aboard. How are you doing today? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Ahoy. Doing good? That's good to hear. I'm doing great. Thanks. We're trying out this. Uh, uh, okay. Oh, suddenly there's like sound. Sorry. <laughs> There's text down here and there's text up here. Why? No aircraft carriers were spotted. As a reminder, our main objective is to defend Port Moresby. Based on the CIC analysis, the optimal position to launch an airstrike against the invasion fleet is from zone G7. Okay, thank you. Nice. Wait, can I pause? Can I pause the game? There. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Okay, uh, that's good. I'm doing good. Thanks, uh, Fidelity. We are uh, trying out a new game um, that I thought was paid, but apparently it was free. But I got the key for free from the... At least I got the key from the developers uh, uh, through a um, uh, site that gives out keys to content creators. Uh, so we're trying out this. It's uh, very much an early access, uh, I believe. It's at least an early version of it. It's not finished. Uh, game yet, but uh, yeah, it's uh, basically damage control on a carrier, it seems, uh, but it might be actually more extensive. It might be that we actually have to send out sorties and stuff like that. But yeah, it's uh, so far we haven't really played it yet. We're just into the first mission, just gone through like the introduction, introduction phase. Also, yes, thank you, Ruda, for reminding me. We are running a giveaway today. Uh, so if you want to get your hands on Trailmakers, all you need to do is be a follower. And then do exclamation point raffle. You don't need to be here in chat when we're done. Uh, or when we're drawing, because that's like four or five hours from now. I don't know. <laughs> thank you, Ruda, <laughs> for contributing. A fifth of the way. Are we? I think so. Uh, maybe more. Did I set it to 50k or... Wait, what are stuff happening? No. Is stuff happening? Okay, or whenever uh, you want to find out how to operate certain functions, just press the help button. A different tutorial will be displayed depending on what you're doing. 36% raised, what? Oh yeah, because you've done, you've done 20%. Okay, never mind. Yeah, okay, never mind. I was like, well, but 10k is not 36% of 50,000. Well, oh, right. Okay. Uh, okay. Keep scrolling to change. We have to free cam. Nice. Okay. Where are we? Help buttons. Help. Welcome yes. Admiral. Good to see you in command. This is your aircraft carrier in all its glory. It is your duty yeah, to skins. keep running and ensure the safety of its crew. Different parts of the carrier are responsible for different functions. 
Here are the main ones you have access to. This is the flight deck. You will prepare plans for your planned missions here. This is the island, the brain of the operation. It's where you and your officers work. Below the deck, damage control crews will put out fires and pump out water whenever your carrier suffers damage. You can access a lot of crucial management tools using okay. the buttons up here, such as maps and the crew management panel. Whenever you feel lost, click the help button to learn more. Yo, Kev, okay, thank you so much for the, uh, for the contribution. How are you doing today? Oh my god, if we're gonna we're gonna end in this situation, aren't we? It's just like tons of fire. Open the crew management panel and assign your crew to the deck and damage control department. Tarin says fuck oof. Hard a tough night at work. And assign him to the navigation room. Allows to set waypoint, breaking radio allow breaking radio silence. Uh, okay. Open the list of orders. The DC reinforcement order requires two Navy points assigned to oh, the Navy did I press? Navy rooms on the island. Oh, <laughs> what? <laughs> That's random, Kev. Did you figure out about the robotic voices, by the way? Did, did that solve itself yesterday? Remember that summon teams will disband automatically when the order ends. Make sure your damage control teams are placed strategically on both ends of the carrier and in the middle. In order to move a DC team, select a DC portrait and click on your chosen room. Your team will create a path and follow it. DC teams can fix almost any kind of damage in section's view. Send them to put out fires. Push it was just a laggy day. I didn't see any lag. Like, okay. Rescue injured crew. That's good. Fix malfunctions and to repair destroyed sectors after damage. I am You can leave your DC teams in one of two key sections in order to prevent damage oh, ship from getting out of hand. Leaving a DC team in any room in the pump section will pump out water of all flooded rooms down to a certain level. Leaving a DC team in any room. That's rising, of course. Uh, like I mean, it's uh, it's also nice to know. Like if that would happen to me, I don't see a cat. It's very. It's you can see her as a speck over there, the brown thing on the bed, all the way in the distance. I have not paid attention to this tutorial. I'm just wasting time now, aren't I? <laughs> buttons are only active when a DC team is in the maintenance section. Click on the button and then click on the malfunctioning section in order to quickly fix the problem. Oh, I have no idea what's going on. Did Jay show ever show up? Yes, he did. Actually, he showed up towards the end together with Bolis and uh, Stiam. <laughs> because apparently uh, the notification of me going live they got that like when I was like four and a half hours into the stream. Then they were just like, oh, Captain Warren has gone live. So that was, uh, I don't know if that was why like so few showed up in the beginning, but that's at least what they said. I'm just like, they just got notification. I was just like, <laughs> we've been playing this game for five hours. <laughs> they ain't true fans, not like you, Kev. I appreciate it. Did you get notification now, by the way? Or are you just like, I haven't checked, are you just uh, such a bowler that you're like on my Discord notification crew? That you get like pings. Every aircraft carrier needs an escort. Make sure to diversify your strike group composition as a part of the intermission preparation. When in the game, you can access the intermission panel by clicking on this button. Each ship in your escort will provide passive bonuses. In order to check what they do, hover over a chosen ship and look here. Many of these bonuses increase your escort defense. The total of this nope, my notices are turned off. I'm um, always checking. Okay, cool, cool. Defensive capabilities of your escort. In case yeah, no, I, I know that pings are super... Uh, I feel like... Uh, yeah, yeah, I totally understand, Kev. Uh, same with, like, also with me on, like, Discord. I turn off most people's notifications. Escort defense will count against it. If an enemy attack is stronger than your escort defense... The difference will be subtracted from the random ship's durability. Okay. If the durability goes down to zero, the escort ship is lost. 
Your escort has active skills. Hover over a chosen ship to display its active skill description. Okay, cool. Active Let's move our carrier. Okay, can I pause? No, I can. Parameters. Speed. And yeah. Direction. So actually, what I've done, Kev, because I know this is annoying, I've um, I've added. You can opt yourself in and out to what I call the signal crew or the notification squad. Uh, and then you will get like pings. There I will like ping at here, uh, like going live, uh, small stuff. And then I almost never use at everyone, uh, at all. Like that is super high bar. Then it's like, okay, now we're like, I think I used it for my birthday. And that's the first time in like half a year I've used at everyone. Because, yeah, I don't want that. I know people get tired of spam. So it's like, yeah, if you know, if you want to get spam, you have the option. If not, I respect. I try to respect that. It really is. And I, I, I do annoy myself a bit with people who do that for like every time they go live. Just like at everyone or the, at everyone going live in half an hour at everyone. I'm a bit late at everyone. Person has gone live. It's like, oh. Okay, what it, uh, I did not pay attention. Oh my god, I'm gonna we're gonna sink so hard. The strike group's direction can be in order to move the carrier, you have to set two parameters speed and direction. The speed of the carrier can be set by clicking on this button. In order to reach full speed, you'll need at least three crew units assigned to the navigation department. To assign them, click on this button to open the crew management panel and assign units by dragging them onto navigation slots. Wait for them to reposition and go back to settling the speed. Okay. The strike group's direction can't be set on the tactical map. There is one requirement though. First, go to the island and check the navigation room. Make sure the allow setting waypoint switch is active. If it is, click here to open the tactical map. Click on this icon next to your strike group. Now, choose a location on the map. The carrier okay. will move towards it. With this oh. method, you can set up the three waypoints. Click right mouse button to stop setting waypoints. Once okay. placed, you can delete existing waypoints by right clicking on them. Existing yeah, this is nice. This is good. And to alter the oh, that's actually really nice. You can alter. You don't need to. Okay. Uh, hate those beefs. You know what I hate more? I have constantly 500 plus, like, red icons <laughs> like like on red notifications on my discord uh and most of it is on channels i've said not to notify me but still it's like oh someone there's someone who has notified you we're not pinging you but we're letting you know that there's like an at everyone here and that annoys the fuck out of me i i set uh off notification for a reason so i don't like have all those red dots Uh, join my Discord, you sat there one every five minutes. I just like to check in on you guys. I, it's because I care about you. You can manage your crew units by clicking on this button. <laughs> there there one. I. Each one is described by the number of assigned units and overall department efficiency. You can check how efficiency affects each department by hovering over here. Efficiency can be boosted in many ways. First, make sure that you assign specialized units onto their favorite departments. You can check a unit's specialty by hovering over their portraits. Your basic units will progress and level up throughout the game. Then, go to Island View and set the coding room switches and the operations room switches. Finally, simply assign <laughs> units, even an unspecialized and inexperienced unit. Talkers are good, indeed. Efficiency slightly. In order to reassign a unit, Drag it over to another slot. So what's the plan for today, Kev? Need some time to reposition and start working again. Oh my god. Okay. Well, you know what? We're just gonna we're just gonna figure this out a bit as we go along. But now we know. Uh, let's go to the. Uh, let's put. Better get to it. Okay. What can you update weather information? Let's get you up there. Yeah, it's a bit hard to change the. Uh, okay, let's see. There was a crew panel. Uh, Anti-aircraft gun will put you into navigation for now.
Let's see, assume strategic position of, uh, optional. Let's do that. How do I, let's see. Oh, I can only delete last one. Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, why why is there no bow wakes on any other ship? Okay, this is what I'm meaning with it. it's a bit unfinished. The camera movement is also horrible. <laughs> right now. Let's see. Can we just have... Uh, let's see. Let's have... Dive bombers ready. Let's have torpedo bombers ready. Let's have more dive bombers and then let's have a fighter planes. Just ready. Uh, uh, I'm relaxing. I'll go for a walk. With nice, 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 nice. Oh, lol. <laughs> gotta, gotta, gotta go fast. What if <laughs> yeah, why, why are you up? Like, like, did you just come home from work or something oh shit i did not pay attention what was that full speed ahead how are we doing on defensive fleet destroyers can we like send out planes oh we don't have any scouting not enough planes on deck Okay, we need bombers for that. Recon, we need two bombers on deck, two bombers on deck. Oh, okay, now I understand. Guys, chop, 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 chop. Can I, like, move crews around now? Maybe I need to do that. Uh... Let's see, uh, deck, air department. What does this do? Medical department, we don't need medics right now. We need uh, deck personnel, I think. Issue a fighter squadron on the deck. Okay, more squadrons on deck. Okay, we can do recon, identify targets, prepare. Then that over here. Like, do I need to... Can't I just be like that? No? What? Okay, cool. Come on, crew. Yes, come on, crew. Oh, okay, here we have... Oh, but we don't have a pause button. That's a bit annoying. I would like to pause. Oh, the second click is the rendezvous point. Okay, so that's bad. <laughs> okay, thank you, Fidelity. <laughs> I went uh, to bed right after work and I woke up early. Oh, big oof. Five hours ago. So you just feel like all rested. By the way, do you have any uh, Easter holiday, Kev? Uh, okay, so... If they're already identified, these aren't identified though, but can I instead just send a airstrike on these? No, mission not. Identify target, recon, recon. Ready. Wait. Let's see, maybe I have to go into Good to see 10 missions. Okay, let's see there. Okay, yeah. You can plan, prepare, deploy, and retrieve them using buttons available on this panel. In order to add missions to the mission panel, or to change kinds of available missions, go to the island view and use switches in the flag plotting room, pilot debriefing room, or CIC. Different missions require different preparation. In order to send counter scouts, counter submarines, scouting patrol, or combat air patrol missions only basic requirements must be met the deck must be in launching state it must be daytime 
The weather must be optimal. All squadrons required for the mission must be present on the deck, and the deck must be operational, meaning there are no wrecks on the deck. If all of these requirements are met, just the good island active mission. That's okay, thank you. Missions such as recon, airstrike, and identify targets will require you to specify a target or a target area and a recovery area. Click on the prepare button to open the tactical map and set all of the requirements. In the case of the recon mission, your target can be set anywhere on the map. When setting up the airstrike mission or the identify targets mission, your target must be an enemy or an unidentified object on the map. Remember that you can drag the target area and the recovery area around. Make sure that the recovery area is close to the carrier. You won't be able to retrieve your squadrons if the strike group is not within that area. When you finish, click okay, the there's a confirm button. button there. Okay. Missions on the mission panel oh. will move between different tabs of the panel. On each step of the preparation, up until the retrieval, custom missions will sometimes appear on the mission panel. You can read their description by hovering over. Let's see, uh, uh, CAP mission, airstrike mission, I guess I want to put you to On my way. Sir. one. Airstrike. Use this to attack and freeze based choose on target fitting strategy. Uh, yeah. See. Repeater bombers. Do how many do I have on deck? Target lock destroy. Okay, and then I can. Okay, we'll, we'll do the light cruiser. So how many do I have on deck right now? What do I have on my deck? Can I see that here? Okay, here I can see. So fighter, two bombers and one torpedo. Let's add another than just torpedo bomber. Issue a torpedo bomber squadron on the deck. And then we'll do uh, airstrike, prepare on them. Uh, you can have a max of six aircraft. Okay, I thought it was four. I read wrong earlier. <laughs> well, I'll place some torpedo bombers on your deck then, Kev. <laughs> Death of maneuver, number five, 150%. <laughs> oh, baby, hell yeah. The card sale, but, uh, yes. So that's, uh, if we do this. And this. Let's see, that's. Can I only do one target at a time? Because that seems to be. So guaranteed to take out this. Because that's 28 strike, right? Versus their 15 defense. This one. Oh, okay, can I. Modifiers of the maneuver three and four disabled. I guess I can't really do. Number three. Oh, do I have to like. No? What? Okay, so that increases that one. Oh my god. That will be 58. That will beat them, but do I have enough? I don't think I have enough planes on deck for that. But I can put out another... I need three torpedo. I need another torpedo. Admiral, we're taking water. What? Send easy teams to pump it out. 
What the hell just happened? Okay, uh... Confirm. Confirm. Another torpedo bomber on deck. What the hell just happened there? Oh, it annoys me that I can't like pause or go slower. Where the hell is... Okay, so there's a uh, damage control. What the hell? 